let's be real. We are all dry shampoo addicts these days. Ah! Welcome back to Sparkle and Grow. Jamie here. I am so excited to be doing a, another MLM review for you guys. Today I am going to be reviewing the Monat. I still can't figure out how to pronounce it. Monat? Monate? I want to say Monate. Tell me in the comments how you pronounce it because one thing I have noticed with this brand is that even all of the consultants and reps pronounce it differently so <laughs> I have no idea but tell me in the comments how you pronounce it and maybe someday I will start pronouncing it correctly we will see but anyways we I'm just gonna call it monate so hopefully it's correct and if it's not hopefully I don't drive you too crazy so um, but it is the monate the champ conditioning dry shampoo I believe that this bottle right here is one of their newer products in their line. So if you don't know what Monet is, it is a primarily hair care company, although they have added, I believe in the last year, like skincare, maybe some pet care products. There are new products being added to the line, but they're most well known for their hair products. The company claims to be naturally based and free of all of those harmful chemicals that are in so many of your shampoos that you would get at the store and maybe even in the salon. I will say that I really like that this company is Leaping Bunny certified, so everything is completely cruelty free and verified to be so. So as we all may or may not know, dry shampoo is typically not so good for your hair, okay? I This is what I typically use. So this is what I'm kind of comparing it to. This is my everyday go-to dry shampoo. I love this one because it's texturizing. It is the Beach Babe Nacho Mothers Be Texturizing Dry Shampoo. You can get this over the counter at your regular grocery store. It's nothing super fancy. It absorbs excess oils. It also has texture and says leaves no residue. This one has like a toasted coconut smell, although I must say uh, it makes me gag slightly. So hopefully it smells good after the whole initial like breathing in of basically powder spray. So what a dry shampoo typically does is it's some sort of absorbent powder. A lot of times it's starch and this one is definitely starch. It also has some other ingredients that I can't pronounce. I don't know. But <laughs> so what happens is when you start putting dry shampoo on your hair and it's something that dries it out like that, you can get a lot of breakage. It's really harsh on your hair. And I have really, really, I have weird hair okay because it's really fine so it's like i have very little hair but i actually have quite a bit of hair for how fine it is but it's very thin it's very fine it's very limp and so body and oil uh, oil is my biggest enemy like if i either have to wash my hair non-stop all the time which we also know is not so good for it or I have to use products that help my hair last a little bit longer so that it's not weighed down. I don't have a lot of texture in my hair because it is so fine and it is so limp. And so I'm really excited that she sent me this because the biggest issue with typical dry shampoo, hence the name dry shampoo, it's going to dry out your hair and your hair is going to break and it's so bad for your hair, but I can't stop using it. So... This baby right here claims to be more healthy for your hair. It helps to freshen hair, absorb oil, condition, and add volume without the need for water. So neither one needs water, but this one claims to also help condition your hair while having the drying effect. So that definitely perks my ears up and interests me. So it's supposed to be a lot healthier for your hair. And I'm going to see for you guys today if it works. All right, so let's read real quick on their website, just a little bit. Features a waterless shampoo that absorbs oil, dirt, and impurities between washes. Um, refreshes your hair, leaves your hair looking, feeling fresh and clean. 
micro fine rice starch. So it still has starch in it, um, but it's micro fine. So that's nice, especially since I don't want anything that weighs down my hair, being that I have such fine hair. Um, and expands to add volume at the roots. That's kind of cool. It expands. I didn't know that. I mean, I guess it makes sense um, without whitening residue. So that's nice. I mean, for me, I can kind of get away with it because I have such light colored hair anyways. But I know my daughters have brown hair and I go and spray these dry shampoos on their hair. There's always like this white that I have to kind of like brush into their hair so you can't notice it. So it'll be nice to see if this does not have any residue. That will be a big bonus. It also uses organic sugarcane alcohol to assist in quick drying because alcohol is going to dissipate. So although you're putting alcohol on your hair, it's going to evaporate quickly. Um, helps provide shine without the over drying. So that's cool. That's probably the shine, but it evaporates. So there's not so much drying. Cool. Um, infused with Rejuvenique. So Rejuvenique is a Monat, Monate, Monate product. <laughs> it's like their exclusive oil, I guess. I'm not sure. I honestly have not tried that one yet. So um, any of you that want me to try that one, send it my way and I will review for you. Um, today, this, by the way, did I say it at the beginning? If I didn't, shame on me. But this was sent to me complimentary from my friend Carla um to try and test this product for you on camera for you to see um all my reviews are legit and real whether i love it whether i don't love it the products are sent to me from consultants and i will share the website of the consultant that sent it to me so if you have any questions or you're interested in ordering please connect with them i am not a rep for any mlm companies i don't do direct sales anymore specifically so that i can give you these non biased reviews i just love being a youtuber and so i also kind of loved the community of network marketing there was an excitement about it for me i did really well in network marketing but i decided to kind of shift my focus there's nobody really doing these non-biased reviews for mlms and so i thought there was like this need and space for it so that's why i started doing this see i have a video all about it way back in my timeline from june maybe is kind of when i started it so that is why i'm doing these and so this is actually my first monate product and so i'm never exclusive necessarily to one person but i am going to share the person's link that sent me the product i love carla to death i have known her for years not outside of network marketing even i know her in real life in person she's a really great person and so i highly recommend you chat with her she's incredibly knowledgeable she's been with the company for so long and i can't recommend her enough she's amazing so all of her info by the way will be in the description of this video so that you can connect with her if you are interested in this product but the Rejuvenique is, oh, it says for vital nutrients to condition strands and help keep hair looking healthy. So I think it's some sort of vitamin oil for your hair that helps keep your hair super healthy. So that's kind of cool. Gentle on hair. That's what I wanted to hear. Creates no dulling residue, helps to extend styles second and third day. So that is one thing. That's one thing I actually, I have tried the Rejuva beads, although I haven't done any sort of official review on that um that is a kind of a creamier version with the rejuvenique in it i believe and i've put that in the tips of my hair before i straighten my hair and my hair really does stay straight for multiple days and my hair is so fine it never holds any sort of heat to it and with that product it does so i don't even think that's the purpose of that product i think it's to help with split ends but that product does that for me and that's actually why i like that product more than the split ends thing all right great for those with limited time or with no access to water so yeah i'm a mom so i you know need to like make my days last <laughs> you know what i mean okay cruelty free and vegan as well let's do this let's put this in my hair so i did not wash my hair at all today i wanted it to be day old so you could see how lovely and greasy it looks oh my gosh i can't believe i'm showing you close-ups of my hair i actually would like to zoom in even more 
I'm like showing you way I feel so vulnerable right now. Okay, so this is my hair. And it says to go 10 to 12 inches away from the hair, focusing on the roots. So I just wanted to show you the kind of before, okay? Now let's zoom back out. Ah. All right. I got my handy dandy unicorn hairbrush given to me by my bestie Bo. All right, that was a birthday present a few years back. I just can't give up this brush. So I'm going to go ahead, I usually kind of brush my hair out and then spray it kind of into the roots a little bit. It does have a really nice mist. It, um, at first, I, whenever I spray anything out of spray bottles, I never know exactly, you know, how it's gonna come out. So I'm always like, ah! But it really actually does have a really nice fine mist. It does definitely have that kind of aerosol spritz going on, but it is completely comfortable to use. Okay, so I don't see any of that white residue that we were talking about. I don't know how much I should put in here. Okay, that's one side. Oh, it does have a little bit maybe, but I really think that's normal, even for the ones that say they don't have it. <laughs> so it's, I mean, it's a starch and it, it absorbs the oil in your hair. So even if it, even the ones that do have that right white residue, it's going to go away because the oil in your hair is going to absorb it. And then naturally it's going to be part of your hair. You just see it at first, but, um, I really think this one is very minimal compared to other ones I've seen. I've seen ones where you spray it on your hair and there's like a white patch on there, you guys. So this is nothing like, and again, I am not a rep. I do not sell this. I'm not making any money off of this. I am just sharing what is really happening. Oh my gosh. This is the first time I've used this too, by the way. I am doing my full first impression. It was actually really hard because if you've seen any of my videos right recently, you know I'm actually way behind on my review. See, it does have like some whiteness to it, but it's going to absorb as soon as I brush it in. Um, but if you've seen any of my videos recently, you know that I'm way behind on videos. So I have had this at my house for well over a month, if not two months, and I've been dying to use it, but I know that I wanted to have my first impressions be on here with you guys so that I could give my honest feedback and honest review um, and also kind of get feedback and information from you guys. Maybe this is a lot of product. Okay, I'm gonna try to and it might have been a little close to my head on some of those, but I don't know. I'm a rule breaker, I guess. Maybe. But I did try to do the 10 inches on this side. So this side I did honestly get kind of close to my head. It says to do 10 to 12 inches. I was definitely not 10 to 12 inches away. I like to get kind of back here where your hair gets greasy a little bit too. maybe a little bit underneath. So I feel like somebody's gonna freak out in this video about how much I'm using, but I wanna see how this stuff works. And I, I mean, hopefully it doesn't make it weigh it down, but I, it should give it more texture and make it lighter, right? Cause it's the start, but it does have oils in it that's not normally in other ones. So I'm curious to know how that balance is going to work. If my hair is still going to, all right, I'm going to brush this through a little bit more and then we'll zoom back in. So you can see what it looks like now. I do feel like it feels, it feels really lightweight. So I definitely hands down give it that. It is actually much lighter than this. Not your mother's a lot lighter. Um, the, my, the, not your mother's feels like you're spraying powder on your hair. I mean, you are cause it's starch, you know, <laughs> but let's see. All right. Let's do this a zoom. All right. <laughs> do you see how white? Okay. I got it. 
let's brush that in. See, once you brush it in, you can already tell, even just that one brush. It looks way more normal once it starts absorbing. So I promise that even if you have that, it does go away. Even on the worst ones, that whiteness goes away. So it, I'm not going to say it doesn't have white residue. It does. But I do think that that goes away super fast, super easy. Um, I do feel like my hair is more hydrated than before. And it definitely has a little bit more texture, but it's really light texture. It makes it more movable. Um, I still see a little bit of oil going on. All right, I can tell that my hair is definitely starting to absorb it a little bit more. It looks a lot nicer than it did just a few minutes ago. I like it. It's definitely, it definitely still has a little, I don't know. I can't explain it. It's kind of like, let's see. Let's try to find the words for this. Cause I still feel like there's some oiliness to my hair, but that's, pro but honestly, it's probably a good thing. So because of the way I damage my hair with the other ones. So I feel like long-term use, this is going to be way healthier. It feels really lightweight. Like my hair feels really movable. It feels like it does add some good texture. I do, I don't know, like maybe I'm just so used to this one. That's probably so bad for my hair that it has more, this one, that other one has, this one has more of like a dry, like it literally feels like you're putting thick powder in your hair, which I feel like adds maybe a little bit more texture, also adds weight, also adds damage to your hair. So like I said, I think I'm just used to this one. But this one feel, does feel really like, it feels really lightweight. It feels healthy. It shows good on camera. I do still think there's some moisture, but like I said, that's probably a good thing in my hair. Um, let's see if I can add a little bit more in even. And I don't know, how much do you guys use? Tell me in the comments how much you use. Do you use quite a bit or will it weigh it down more because there's oil in it? I don't know this is a good question like where is the balance between powder and oil but it does feel like i can't like, it feels so much healthier i i have to tell you that part so if you're worried about breakage and if you have really like dry hair my hair is me i don't dye my hair i will give you guys that i do not dye my hair this is my natural hair color it's my natural hair i really do nothing to my hair but like i literally i trim it like every two to three years is that terrible i know it probably is some hair my best friend is a hairdresser okay um actually two of my best friends are hairdressers but i have a fear of hairdressers i don't know like actually cutting my hair obviously i don't have a fear of them if they're my friends but okay maybe i just need like more to get to the level Ooh. That was kind of close to my head. I just sprayed you guys. <laughs> like I said, it rubs in, obviously. Um, after a few minutes, it definitely rubbed in my hair. Ooh, actually, I'm liking it more as I put more in. I can feel the texture a lot more. I feel like maybe I needed more product. I was just kind of doing maybe how much I would put with this. This one, maybe I needed less, but it's also going to hurt my hair more. And I probably... It probably wouldn't last as long, honestly. Kind of putting it underneath the back of my hair there. Okay, where's my brush? All right, here it is. Let's use an actual brush. Honestly, like, the level of white residue in my hair right now is nothing compared to many of them. And look, it really does absorb really nicely. And I kind of like that it sometimes lightens my roots a little bit. I'm, I don't dye my hair, but I still get dark roots because my hair gets so sun bleached because I spend so much time at the beach. Like every month I'm at the beach. <laughs> I'm definitely one of those beach bums. All right.
I'm liking it. You know what? I just needed more product. I did because I am liking it much more. So I do feel like maybe you need a little bit more product with this product, more product with the product. <laughs> but I will say it works really well. I really do like the texture and the volume. This feels super nice. Now that I've put more in, maybe it takes a little bit to activate because it, remember, it said it expands over time. We read that together, remember? <laughs> oh my gosh. Jamie, remember what you read. But my hair, it does. It's feeling like, and it's really lightweight still. It feels really hydrating. My skin, or my skin, my hair. I talk about skincare so much. My hair, <laughs> um, I'm, like, I'm liking it more as I sit here longer. No, I'm liking it as I sit here more and more. I'm not going to make you guys sit here with me forever, but... I do feel like the longer I sit here, the more absorbed it is and the better my hair's feeling. And look at the texture. I mean, rewind this video to the beginning and look at this texture. I feel, I do feel like my hair has some like volume going on, like a oh, va va boom, boom, va va boom. I like it. I'm gonna, I feel like I'm really gonna like this product. I'm excited that I finally opened it. Good find, Carla. Thank you for sending this to me. Revives, refreshes, conditions with rejuvenate. Yeah. Dry shampoo. Look at my hands. <laughs> so maybe if you use quantities that I use. Uh, I think my hair is just different. My hair is really not like most people's. It's very fine. But I actually really like it. One thing that I like. Okay, so it still adds the texture and all that stuff. Look, I can move my hair and then it's like stuck in this crazy texture. That's a good sign with dry shampoo because that means your hair is now movable. And if you guys knew how fine and limp my hair was, you'd be like blown away amazed at the fact that my hair did that right now. Like what, what crazy formation can I do with my hair right now? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Glamour shots. Glamour shot photo shoot. All right, there it is. My first Monate, correct me if I'm pronouncing it wrong, my first Monate review. I'm impressed. I'm actually really impressed. And if this is healthier for your hair, I would definitely, definitely recommend it because dry shampoo really is so bad for your hair. It breaks your hair. This one that you get over the counter has zero conditioner in it. And to find a conditioner that's going to still keep the texture in my really thin, fine hair is super impressive. And knowing that it feels hydrated, really lightweight, that it definitely absorbed the oil and know that it takes a few minutes apparently because at first I was kind of like, well, it still looks that way. But let's zoom in again. Let's zoom in again. Look, it's been, I don't know, nine minutes, it looks like, since I started recording. And it looks significantly better than when I first sprayed it on. My hair looks really healthy. It looks nice. It does not look like a ton of powder is in it. And it really doesn't have any white residue anymore. Probably because at first, maybe even if you see that white residue, it's going to be absorbed and then it's going to, it sounds like, expand. So once it has that oil, it's adding that texture. I don't know if it's using my own oil to expand the starch and add the texture, but it does feel really lightweight. It feels nice. It doesn't feel like dry, like it's going to break. Um, yeah, I would recommend trying this. Um, one thing that I've come across with the Monate is that the reps will try to sell you the VIP price. I'm just going to tell you to pay the full price, okay? Here's why. And I don't know if it's still like this, but a while back I had tried it and I had gotten on VIP and it costs money to be a VIP and then you get discounts, right? So I paid the money, I got the discount because the shampoos are 
are a little bit more, and by a little bit more, I mean a lot of it more than the stuff that you buy in the store. However, they also last a lot longer. You need a lot less and it's way healthier for your hair. So I know why it costs that and it should cost that, but, um, but you get a discount when you join VIP. What they don't tell you is you have to buy three times before they allow you to even cancel and if or you can pay a like twenty dollar fee to cancel it so you pay a fee to get in it to get the discount and you pay a fee if you want to get out of it unless you buy three times and when the shampoo and conditioner sets are like 80 bucks you're like that's a lot of money so um if you like it if you love the monate products which you might because they actually are pretty rad um, I highly recommend it, but at first just pay the extra $10. Okay. <laughs> Cause the extra $10 is cheaper than realizing you don't want to continue to spend that amount of money on your shampoo. But I do highly recommend you try it because I think they have a lot of really great products. And if that's something that you can afford, you definitely should go for it. But if you're somebody who might have a hard time affording that, on a consistent basis or you're not sure if you like it yet or not um, I would wait just pay the full price just pay it okay um, and know that you can always join the VIP later if you decide you love it and you want to continue with it there's nothing wrong with the VIP but I feel like a lot of consultants themselves aren't very upfront about all of the rules that are involved with VIP they just want to give you the discount and then you find out later that you have to buy so many times and all this stuff um, so I wanted to be transparent about that, but I, it does not mean I don't love the product. I think the company has a great concept and the products are actually really, really good. So there's that, <laughs> but I am going to put Carla's information in the description below her shopping link, her contact information on Facebook so that you can connect with her there. I highly recommend you chatting with her because this was actually really bomb and I'm really excited to use this. I'm going to continue to use this because I really do like how lightweight it feels in my hair being that I have such fine hair. It took a second for it to absorb to a point where I thought that I loved it and I'm pretty happy with it. Hmm. What do you guys think? Have you tried this product? Have you tried other Monate products? What is your experience with Monate? Leave me all the love, all the comments. Let's get some chat going in the comments of this video. That is what these videos are for, for a non-biased space to talk about MLM products. So you can also check out my profile to see what other MLM product reviews I have done. Coming up here really soon, I am going to be doing some Bellamy skincare, and I'm also going to be trying the Color Street nail strips, and I feel like there is something else. I don't know, but make sure you're subscribed. Give this video a thumbs up if it was helpful. I'll see you in the next video. Have a fabulous, fabulous hair day.